This must be flawless on a mechanical and mathematical level. First, download game. Then, calculate number of spins. Place spins on the clock. After, do some killer math and conclude with killer catchphrase. Is the ace of Vegas, the ace of Vegas. And welcome back to Ace of Vegas, Spinners and Sharks. Ace here, and I hope you're doing well. And I'm back! <laughs> well, back from Vegas anyway, and it was a great time. So I just want to go ahead and let you guys know about that. More content is on the way, just in case you guys didn't know. I'm sure you've already seen the room tour, so I've got a trip report coming out this week. Um, I had to delay a couple other videos because there's a certain new law that I wanted to go ahead and address and address some changes to the channel. You've probably already seen a little change to the channel, and there are going to be a couple more just to make sure that we're in compliance with a couple new YouTube regulations, uh, and uh, we can last as long as we can. So I'll go over that in that separate video. Don't worry. We're still going to have fun today. And uh, yeah, I'm ready to go ahead and spin down our uh, third to last game here. The Sheer Luck Hound. So obviously this is a parody of uh, Sherlock Holmes, The Adventures of Sherlock Holmes, and uh, Watson, and you have all the classic characters. you got Lars, you got Irene Adler over here, Jabs too. So always a good time. Then of course you have uh, uh, Holmes' signature pipe over here, magnifying glass, because he is the greatest detective in the world. Sorry, Batsy, you're a pretty good detective, but not the greatest detective in the world. But you know what? You do a lot of other good things. You know, it's good to be Batman anyway, so... All right, guys. Well, without further ado, let's go ahead and put 100 spins on the clock. We'll be betting at 3 million per swing and risking 300 million loyalty points here. So let's go ahead and get this started. On your mark, get set, ready, and go. All right, that's our first one. Never played uh, Sheer Luck Hound before, so I'll be very excited to see what the mystery bonuses are like. All right. <laughs> Meowiarty. Oh, <laughs> Moriarty's Meowiarty. That's, uh, that's actually kind of funny. All right, I can get behind with that. I can definitely get behind that. Okay, cool, cool. Well, let's go ahead and see how we do on this one over here. Also wanted to go ahead and take a second to give a shout out to my boy uh, Ray over at uh, Vacation Impossible there. Uh, Ray, thanks for dropping by the podcast. If you guys missed out on that, definitely go ahead and make sure to check the link in the upper right-hand corner of the screen over there. I'll go ahead and put a link to that so that you guys can enjoy that after you're done watching this over here. And, uh, yeah, also wanted to go ahead and thank uh, my Spinners and Sharks here. So while you guys uh, selected my next hotel, unfortunately I wasn't able to go to Vidara for the days that I picked for my last trip. Uh, but Wendy and I, we are going to Aria for this next trip over here. Already picked up the room nights and got those booked, so we're actually already good to go. So thank you guys for picking somewhere nice for us and not picking Excalibur like you all threatened to. It got pretty close at one point, I think... Uh, I think it ended up being a margin of 53% uh, versus 47%. I was getting a little worried over there, like, oh, I'm not sure if I want to stay at Excalibur. Or maybe I might. I don't know. It might be worth it. Uh, especially now that uh, Circus Circus is out of the MGM Hotels catalog. I'm starting to think that Excalibur might end up being the worst of the MGM hotels, and um, that actually might end up being the one of the worst ones in Vegas if they don't uh, get their act together. And I say that because, as you guys know, Phil Ruffin already purchased the Circus Circus, and uh, hopefully, um, I mean, the place basically prints money, because it's all paid for and it's still open. So hopefully he decides to go ahead and put a little bit more cash into it, get it cleaned up and refreshed, and uh, maybe makes it a decent property again. So we'll go ahead and see. Uh, but anyway, yeah, we're getting ready for our December trip already. Lots of fun things that we did for the November trip over here, and you guys got to join me on, including the Ka show. Uh, a couple little things that we didn't get to do that I'll go over in the trip report this uh, this weekend, but... Yeah, next time we'll uh, we'll make sure that we get all those things done. It'll be a good time. I just gotta make sure I'm not uh, cannibalizing too many of the rewards there, just so I don't overdo it. Oh man, we were so close to that mystery bonus. It's cool though. It's cool. All right. Uh, trying to think of any other fun stuff that we're gonna do uh, since we're wrapping up our best games in my Vegas slot series. Uh, I was thinking about just doing some more generalized gambling tutorials and also gonna add some more win and binions content in here just so we. Uh, have a better balance of things. All right, halfway through the spins now, 50%. And we're getting there. There's another good one. All right, let's get this mystery bonus, guys. How about that mystery bonus? Ah, uh, 
Robert Downey Jr. is such a tease, man. Puppy <laughs> Robert Downey Jr. there. <laughs> oh, man. What kind, of, what, what kind of dog is he? I think it's a Basset Hound or a blood, Bloodhound. I don't actually know. I'm not good with the dog breeds, guys. So you just go ahead and let me know what kind of dog he's supposed to be in the comment section below. And you know what? I'll just go ahead and believe you. So, oh, are we going to get that uh, bonus this time? Oh, we did get the mystery bonus. Okay, we get to pick a mystery bonus here. Let's go. Let's go. Um, do I do I actually pick one of the? Okay, let's go dead center. Oh, 18 and a half million chips. Oh, that would have been 10 free spins. Okay, I guess you either get chips or spins. That's pretty cool though. It interrupts the auto spins, so we gotta fire that back up again. Did not know that. All right, and I'm. Thinking about the rewards that we've got, trying to plan things out with Boss Lady, so I know for a fact that we're going to the Titanic, and I've definitely got some Aria free play. Yeah, let me know in the comment section down below, guys, if uh, if you guys have ever turned in the Aria free play while you're staying on a My Vegas comp night. Uh, I used to be able to do that, and they didn't say anything. Then they changed the terms and conditions, so I haven't tried it since then. I have gotten away with the My Konami free play. And that did just fine over at Aria, but I haven't tried the official one yet. Oh, okay, we got three. Well, let me pick the middle reel again. We had a good luck with it. Oh, okay, we got those free spins. Twelve free spins. That's what's up. That's what's up. Okay. Let's see how we do with these free spins, guys. Let's see if we can make up some of our uh, bankroll here. All right, that was some good wiles. All right, 19 million. I don't think we're going to get a brilliant payback percentage, but what happens if we get another magnifying glass here in the middle of this, I do wonder. Uh, it's not going to tell us right now, though. Maybe if, Oh, okay. 18 million? Maybe if we're lucky in the last couple spins, it'll change its mind. Give us another magnifying glass. Uh, or the mystery wheel. Let's get another mystery wheel bonus. Let's go, guys. Let's go. Come on, mystery wheel bonus. I'm not sure why I shout at this like it's actually going to change the RNG. <laughs> I feel like I feel like all slot channels do that. Oh, 60 million. All right, all right, all right. We are making the little money back. All right, we got one more free spin after this. Let's go, guys. Let's get that mystery bonus. Come on now, mystery bonus again. No. I feel like it should trigger something for having two of them. Two out of three ain't bad. Man, that was worth a hundred million chips, you guys. Good work, Spinners and Sharks. Good work. Because, again, what we do, our shouting at the screen is affecting the RNG. Don't forget that. Always remember to shout at the screen to change the RNG, because the, the microphone in your phone and in your laptop can hear you. Um, I'm partially convinced that Play Studios is constantly spying on me and trying to keep me into the game by doing these ridiculous little things here. Or maybe maybe not. Maybe they don't know I'm, I exist. I'm a top fan of my Vegas, but that doesn't necessarily mean anything. So, I don't think that they really know that I exist. Which is cool. All good stuff. They don't have to acknowledge that I exist. That's totally fine. Alright, and we are almost through the mystery spins here. Or the regular spins here. I would love to get one more mystery spin. Uh, before the end. Oh, triple <laughs> sheer luck. Okay. Elementary. Good deal. And let's see what else we have here. Now that's about it. So yeah, just getting ready for that December trip uh, about this time next month, a little before Christmas. And that'll be, uh, we'll have some good stuff out for you then. Uh, I was also thinking about taking uh, most of Christmas off. Uh, probably just uh, doing a couple videos that week up until, uh, up until New Year's and just enjoying some time off, uh, just me and the family. So, we'll probably be a little slow on content towards the end of the year, guys. I did take most of December off last uh, last year, too, though. Just FYI. So, it, it'll be a lot like that. But that was before we really started getting kind of popping here. And people were like, oh, I wonder what happened. Well, we'll see. We'll see. But, made it back. So, don't worry. Don't worry. I'll, be, I'll make sure I come back uh, this time, too. All right. Last couple spins here. And let's see if we can get this last... Oh, it was a big one to end it. All right, 22 million. Not bad, not bad at all. So it looks like we're ending on 1 billion, 515 million, 603,000, 
324 chips. That means that it's time for me to take a little break over here. I'll do some maths and we'll uh, count up the booty. All right, spinners and sharks, there's no mystery as to what's going on around here. Sheer Luck Hound is not one of the best games in my Vegas slots. Sorry to say, but we did do the maths, and it is rather elementary that it is only 83.71%, and you have no idea <laughs> you have no idea how long I've been holding on to these jokes for. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry, but you know what? I'm not sorry. It's my show. I'm going to go ahead and do it anyway. Uh, anyway, though, that's about it for this game over here, and we've actually cleared this whole page because we've done Bed Rock and Roll and Pandorama now. And already finished up uh, Real Amigos, which were true amigos to us. They took good care of us. So now, it comes down to 1001 Wilds and Real Chef. So, next time I think we're going to play Real Chef. And then 1001 Wilds is going to be our very last best game in my Vegas slots. And it's going to be a big one. So, get ready for that. Real Chef goes down next week, and then week after that, we're doing 1001 Wilds. So, barring another game being added to the equation here, this is the end of the series. So, we're finally going to have an answer to what game on My Vegas Slots Mobile is the best game to play actively to get loyalty points. So, I'm not sure if you guys are excited about that. I'm excited about that. I've been doing these uh, this series for almost a year, or actually for over a year now. This particular series of videos doing the best games in my Vegas slots and playing every single one of these games over here just so you guys don't have to. And I could show you all the good ones to go with and then you can see all your favorites, like, oh, this bonus looks fun, I can play this, um, I mean, MGM Meg Megastars, that was a blast, too, Real Amigos, that's a good one, too, um, but yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get that, uh, get that all squared, and then you'll have the final answer, I think that'll probably be the last video of the year, so that'll be pretty dope. Alright, well, Spinners and Sharks, until then, this is Ace of Vegas, signing out, wishing you all strong hands, and, of course, happy spinning.